we spend a third of our lives in bed, so it's probably best to invest in comfort. Well, one bed claims to have achieved comfort perfection. The Vividus bed is handcrafted with special materials, including horse hair, Soft. and promised yeah, to, uh, to give you the best night's sleep you've ever had. The only catch is it'll cost you, wait for it, £150,000. Here's what happened when we sent Alice Beer to try out the world's most expensive bed. Our bed, the place of dreams, the centrepiece of the boudoir, where you lay your head at night and let all your troubles disappear. You'll spend 26 years of your life in a bed, and yet is it really up to scratch? The bed I'm visiting today should be, as it's the world's most expensive bed. But where do you find the world's most expensive bed, I hear you ask? Or one of the world's most luxurious this is Seven Seas Splendour and is the newest boat to join the Regent Cruise fleet. Getting ready to set sail for its maiden voyage from Barcelona, it has all the cruise ship essentials. Pool, restaurants, oh, and three and a half million pounds worth of art on the walls, over 500 crystal chandeliers, and an acre of Italian marble, and of course, the world's most expensive bed. More on that later. I'm making my way to the bed's home, the most expensive and luxurious place to stay on the boat. The Regent Suite. It boasts two bedrooms, a spa, hot tub, grand piano, and it's a Picasso on the wall, making it one of the most expensive places to stay in the world. The starting price is from around £8,500 per night. And the average stay? 11 nights. You do the maths. But it does come with your own personal butler. This is Ronnie, who for all that money will see to your every need while you're afloat, including dolphin watching. When there's a view coming up or if there's some dolphins to be seen, exactly. you're going to make sure I don't miss a thing. Of course. Wow. If I miss a dolphin, Ronnie, I'm going to be really cross. If okay? we miss it, we call them back. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you will as well. <laughs> Ronnie, obviously it's all about the bed. Yes. Can you show me? Of course, why not? Thank you. This is the Haston's Vividus bed that cost over £150,000. Complete with built-in TV, it takes a certified bed artisan nine weeks to hand make by layering wool, cotton, mole hair and horsetail hair. It even comes with its own linen and pillow menu. So, uh, I'm quite fussy about my sheets. Yes. And I'm quite fussy about my pillow. What are yes. my options, please? We have the linen, we have the linen menu and the pillow menu as well. Or you can have linen, Egyptian cotton. We have satin, we have tencel. What are my options of pillow, please, Ronnie? We have the lovely foam pillow, then we have the bucket pillow, then we have the water pillow. So A water pillow? Yes. So, I mean, that- Have you tried that? Oh uh, yes, I've tried it and it's very nice. Is it? You will love it. Do you ever have a little kick in the bed when nobody's looking? No. 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 Well, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Time to get rid of Ronnie. Ronnie, could you possibly, I'm sorry if it's too much trouble, could you possibly get me a water pillow? So I will do that. Thank you so much. Thanks. Let's try the bed. It's not quite too hard, it's not too soft, it's a combination of all the things you want. This is excellent. It takes a lot to make me happy in bed. And I'm happy right now. It might be the most expensive bed in the world, but I can honestly say it is also the most comfortable. I just would have quite liked a pillow mint. I wonder why they don't give them out. Wow. I want to try a water pillow. Yeah. That's what I want to try. So I think, it, 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 obviously an incredibly expensive mattress, yeah. so that frames it. The whole, the whole thing as well, yes. Yeah. Well, if you don't have access to the most expensive bed in the world, then maybe our next guest can help you sleep. Yeah. <laughs> Dr. Sophie Bostock.